I don't think popularity equates to fulfillment, even though I feel like nowadays that's what's been trending. Like, if you're not popular or if what you're doing is not popular, it means it doesn't have impact enough or you're not actually in line with your purpose. I don't think that's correct. This is what I think. We all are called into different areas. God has unique callings for everybody. Some people have callings that entail them to be out there, to be public. Others have callings that don't entail them or don't require them to be public. And that doesn't make them any less or that is fulfilled, like their assignments are nothing. It doesn't mean if you are not out there like being celebrated, being applauded for. No, no, we don't have to feel like that. The fact that what you do is not known by hundreds, thousands, millions of people doesn't mean you are not fulfilling purpose. So I think that if we all concentrate on what God has called us to do, you're convicted that this is what God has called me to do. God has called you into leadership. The leadership can be just in your church. It can be just in your family. It can be like you're a world leader. It can be your whatever. But if you're convicted that that's what God has called you to do, being popular or not, being heard by the whole world or not, doesn't make your assignment lesser than anybody's assignment. This goes to say that you have to be confident, satisfied, and focused on what God has called you to do. When you're doing what God has to do, that is the fulfillment you should have. That is the greatest fulfillment you should have. So let's not be under this pressure of popularity. Like if whatever you're doing is not popular, has not gone viral, it means you're not yet there. No. The mindset that should be in you is, I am doing the work of my father. I'm doing the work of the Lord Jesus Christ. And as far as he's been glorified, as far as I'm pleasing the father, I'm, I'm okay. I'm okay. Whether I am at the forefront or I'm in the middle or I, or, or I am at the back, it is okay. There are some people who are backbones of ministries, like intercessors, for example, People who take out time to pray for ministers, take out they don't they don't come to social media and they are doing all doing all the prayers and all of that. But the ministry keeps moving because there are some people who have dedicated their lives and have been called out to pray and intercede specially for the body of Christ. But some of these people we don't know them. We see just the effects. Does that mean they are not fulfilling their purpose capital no so i just want to encourage someone today let's cut off this pressure of being popular means that we are succeeding and not being popular means we are not fulfilling purpose i will confess that sometimes i also fall into that trap or feeling and you know when we have all these feelings they make us lose focus on our godly assignment when we have the understanding of our place of our various ministries i tell you you will not feel any pressure especially in these days you will not feel any pressure to be known like i mean known putting yourself out there just so that you should be known in order to feel like okay you're fulfilling purpose nah 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 if it's what you have to do, God has laid in your heart to do, do it. But you're not doing it to be popular in order to have that feeling of fulfillment. You know, this is a work of faith. Sometimes we make mistakes, sometimes our flesh gets in the way, but we have to get back on track, okay? I believe that if we all focus on our God-given assignment and we are satisfied in these various assignments, different and unique assignments that God has given us, then we are going to feel fulfilled and nothing is going to put us under pressure because we are God's workmanship. We are not human beings' workmanship. Okay? I hope this has blessed you. God bless you. 
and see you next time.